It is time now to show you some of this morning's headlines from around the globe. Wall Street Journal reports on claims that two Chinese telecom companies pose a national security threat to the United States. Last night on 60 Minutes, the chairman of the House Intelligence Committee recommended that American companies should not do business with Huawei Technologies. A congressional report due out today says Huawei and a second firm, ZTE, have equipment that could be used for spying. El Universal in Caracas, Venezuela, says Venezuelan President Hugo Chavez won a third term on Sunday. The socialist got 54 percent of the vote, enough to keep him in office until 2019. USA Today reports two Justice Department agencies, the ATF and the DEA, do not know how often informants are given permission to break the law. The strategy is under new scrutiny after the controversial Fast and Furious gun running program first exposed by CBS News. And Florida Today reports on the launch of SpaceX Falcon 9, the unmanned cargo ship rocketed into orbit Sunday from Cape Canaveral. It is the first private spacecraft to resupply the International Space Station.